Okay, bye. So, yesterday I heard a retail worker at my local smoke, leather, lace, head shop describe steampunk as what happens when goth kids discover brown. And I just... She wasn't wrong. Behold, wizard. And the cooler wizard. Ugh, just because your hat is tilted aside jauntily does not prove your superiority. My wizard hat is set neatly atop my head so that it is secure against strong breezes and someone condescendingly flicking the brim. You know, I can tell that people condescendingly flicking your brim is a recurring issue for you. Wow, so this resume is amazing. I didn't know you could get a PhD for being a babe magnet. Hired. (laughs) <laughs> Literally me when Andy handed me his work credentials. Who are you? I'm your video editor. Damn it, you are handsome. <laughs> I was just thinking the same. We are sexy. We are sexy bitches, yeah. <laughs> you know, we can make anything traumatizing if we theorize long enough. <laughs> I'm dead inside. Keeping the same tabs open for nine days straight because they contain information relevant to tasks you're too lazy to complete. A novel by me. Wow, God said, Let's give this bitch so much self-awareness it's going to stop her from doing literally anything. But we will also make her pretty hot. Hey, stop making shows about Americans in Europe. Try Europeans in America instead. The outrage of not knowing exactly what something costs at a store, no public transport, everyone smiling in your face and waiters scaring you by constantly popping up at your table, ice in your water for some reason. That's the kind of culture clash I want to see. Fuck Emily in Paris. I want Francois in Texas. Imagine your favorite character barging into your room this moment, grabbing your hand and taking you with them into their world. Let's be honest though, most of us would be dead within a week. But it would be a bloody brilliant week. Why do potatoes have more chromosomes than us? What do they need them for? That's none of your business. Fuck Rubik's Cubes. These bitches are impossible. If I had to save my family by solving a Rubik's Cube, I wouldn't even try. I'd let them die. Yeah, I just grumpy because you couldn't solve the puzzle. Oh yeah, don't worry about my leg bouncing. I'm fine. That's just the thing I do when I'm bored. Or excited. Or nervous. Or alive. Problems. One, I want this story to be written. Two, I don't want this story to be written by anyone but me. And three, I don't want to write this story. So occasionally, fossils become opal instead of stone. They are called opalized fossils. Fuck it, opalizes. Opa fossil star. My dearest beloved fuckos. Is a fun, gender-neutral way to begin a speech. See also, esteemed bastards, gentlefolk, ferals, and domesticated cryptids, and my fellow yees and haws. Well, I didn't have a post that ended on screen, so Andy, my man, guess the time it is. Let's do this. Son, I finally found you! After all these years! What are you talking about, man? My dad's right there. No, Kevin, he's right. I'm not your father. I'm your stepfather. (laughs) Papa? Wonder what my guardian angel's doing. Okay, check it out. He's gonna step on a rake. (laughs) The rake wasn't even there before. It just appeared. (laughs) And that's why the Bank of Captain Rich gives you 0.001% interest a year. No, I'll just take my extra money and put it into stocks. You're like, under my bed. Who taught you poor people how to trade stocks? Well, oops, looks like I bought pasta sauce instead of pizza sauce for my pizza tonight. Oh, great, here come the Italians. Hey, hey, what are you hey, doing? Oh, hey, 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 what the hey, fuck hey, is this? Captain Rich, please fix the economy, housing, anything! Have you thought about not being poor? Like, why do the poor just not call the money printer man and ask politely for your regular bag of money? Hello? Money printing man? Give me all this man's money. I feel like I forgot something at home. Well, it's just a McDonald's trip, who cares? Yes, sir, I'm sorry. Only people with foreskin can enter foreskin McDonald's? No, foreskin McDonald's is over there. Yeah, who ordered the mixed circumcised Big Mac? Hmm. 
<laughs> hey, why don't you point that stud detector over here? <laughs> Could you make a beep sound? It would really help my self-esteem. Hey, girl, heard you sad. How about buying some of my life coaching? Uh, oils? Maybe try some of my oils? How about, how about leggings? They're not pyramid schemes, I'm girl buzzing! Okay, don't panic, there's a skinwalker loose and he took my shape, you need to kill him. No, no, do not listen to him, look at me. Me and my human breasts that I've always had that humans like. Yeah, I know the one with the tits is a skinwalker, but I'm really digging their vibes. <laughs> okay, welcome to Team Rocket, here's your unregistered firearm for crime and murder. Yeah, what kind of Pokemon is this? It's a gun. Mariah Carey, the world needs you. Mariah Carey, the Christmas queen, the world begs for your talent. No, no, Nick Cannon did it. You must be able to get the stripes off a candy cane and one bob or something. Hey, welcome to Team Rocket. Hey, man, what's that over there? Oh, that's our teleporting square. If intruders walk on it, they get teleported. Well, that's fucking dumb. Why don't we just hook the teleporter up to, like, a fire pit, a knife, or my ass? You're right, I like how you think. Let's hook that teleporter up inside your ass. And that's why we want to hook the teleporter up inside his ass. You guys are lucky I'm into that. And that's why short stack goblins make the best girlfriends. Yeah, I don't know about that, man. You have no taste. I'm out of here. I need to meet up with my goblin girlfriend. Aw, oh, shit, babe. Did you free transform yourself again? You looking thick. <sighs> okay, what's the problem now? Well, I don't know what I was thinking. It's a little sus you haven't made me your pock champ. What the fuck language is that? Are you speaking to me in Canadian or something? You know, there's just not enough crime in the world. I can change that. And that is my origin story! Not bad! Oh, thank goodness, I found you, Hood Mage. I need some advice on where to take a girl on the first day at- mm mm mm, -mm. Don't you ever talk to me wearing those fake-ass Jordans. I don't tolerate that disrespect. Babe, it's 2 a.m. I need affirmation! Great, now tell me you love me! I love you as much as Sega likes to quality check and debug Sonic games. What the fuck? Why would you say that to me? Hi, sorry for ghosting you. I'm being tormented by psychic horrors beyond your wildest comprehensions. And guess who made those psychic horrors? My brain. Damn, this is such a good song. Let me play it like 78 times an hour until I hate it. Why you gotta call me out like this, man? I love seasonal fruits like, girl, we're back, lol. As a gay person with seasonal depression, I relate to this on a level you probably weren't intending for. COVID must have hit the assassination industry hard. You ever heard of bioterrorism, Pucky? Well, sure, the bioterrorism industry is doing great right now, but us no-nonsense assassins only have guns and a mortgage to pay. I love that when characters don't have a canonical last name, the fandom just slaps the name of the thing they came from as their last name, like Sans Undertale. Um, excuse me. His name is Sans Sans, and his brother is Papyrus Sans, and if you don't believe me, put up this proof right now that Andy's gonna do. Andy, do it. Having ADHD means I get special VIP access to new emotions, such as evil boredom. It's boredom, but it turns me evil. It's like when I arrange my entire office out of spite. <laughs> Hello, Tumblr user. You spend your days closing and reopening the Tumblr app, despite no new posts being made. Now... You must find and select the log off option in the exact correct sequences of clicks, or every app on your phone, including system apps, will become Tumblr. You have 60 seconds. Adding charms and keychains to random things definitely improves the living experience. You're absolutely right. Andy, for the rest of this video, put a cute little charm in the corner. Look at that. How precious. Buy 365 near-identical solid color shirts that range through the entire color spectrum in a loop. It will appear as though you wear the same color shirt every day, but in photos from previous months, you'll be wearing a completely different color. You son of a bitch, I'm so in! <sighs> Andy, we'll be friends forever. Till Paul do us blart. Hello everyone, I spent some time thinking on it, and I've decided that I'm fucking adorable, and there's nothing you can do about it. Hmm. 
You cause eight psychic damage to the commoner. Yes! Killing him instantly. Wait, what? He's just a guy, Bard. He's just a guy. Why is there a pentagram on your floor? Okay, first of all, Mom, it's not a pentagram. And second, what are you doing in my apartment? Oh, shit, I summoned my mom. A parentagram? Congrats on doing what Ed and Al could not. Thor Ragnarok casually glossed over the fact that the Hulk spent two years murdering people for sport. It be like that sometimes. Rip Doug. Pounds a monster at 9 a.m. Ugh, why can't I ever sleep at night? Oh, you're talking about the energy drink. I... I... I thought you were talking about something else. I just... Fuck, Andy, cut, cut the video. Cut the video. I added myself as a degenerate. Just cut the video. I'll take care of this at once. You slut dragon! You slut! Chill out, dude. Slut. Okay, that's slut! You, you don't have slut. to... Slut! Shame on you! Oh, the masculine urge to be petty. The feminine urge to be handsome. I realize now that you said petty and not pretty, but I still agree with your statement. I don't like cheese. I'd be pitiful in a fantasy novel. You're pitiful in real life. Just wanted to show you guys that Muppets Most Wanted Piggy fantasizes about her and Kermit having babies, and this is what they look like. So do with that what you will. <laughs> why, why, does, why does the pig look like Shrek? That's a penis. I cast a spell of giant radioactive laser. Can that be done? Andy, back me up here. Can that be done? Reread zone fix while having writer's block. Well, I wish I could write like this. N60 fact! All those Switch cards contain a bitter N64 cards do not, and are still a great addition to any gamer's diet. There's so many things wrong with this, and you kind of notice them in a particular order. Yeah, yeah, you do. There's no wrong way to consume a piece of media. Yes, there is. Yeah, that's why they made the Switch card to just taste bad! Big fan of those floating rocks of stone that appear whenever a specific planet is in retrograde. And of course, the other ones that appear only either during the day, at twilight, or at night. Thanks! I made them myself. I believe very strongly in, I didn't say it was good, I said I liked it. But that might be even more important is, I didn't say it was bad, I said I hated it. I just want to say if you hate something good because it sends terrible messages, that's fine. But you can also just hate it because you hate it. Free yourself of the struggle to find a good enough reason. Sometimes it just doesn't hit right. Reblog if you think gay marriage is legal in Bikini Bottom. Well, how else could Squidward and Squillian be divorced? Very good point. Deleting files is such a rush. Mm. Free enough disk space. Oh, baby. I think we're running out of posts to make. Oh, old two terabyte Ted over here thinks they're hot shit, huh? Today I learned that in 1949, a member of the New Zealand Parliament was deemed to have used unparliamentary language for saying of another member that his brains could resolve inside a peanut shell for a thousand years without touching the sides. Well, it is pretty rude to just straight up kill a man in Parliament like that. Don't date people who make you feel like you have to hide your stuffed animals. This is, without exaggeration, probably the best dating advice I have ever seen. What's so sexy about necromancers, you ask? One, goth. Two, hubris. And three, recycling. You go inside, and there's a possum on the counter. And you order a foot-long chicken teriyaki, and it uses its mouth to pile various sticks, acorns, leaves, and bugs onto 12 inches of mossy, damp tree bark. It's the best subway you've ever had. And it's still fresher. All right, this fuck right here has no neck, and I just realized there's nothing holding his arms and shoulders to his body. What, why are SpongeBob profile pics for blogging this? I'm so goddamn scared. What the fuck, man? Oh, you fucked up now, son. The two ADHD moods in a nutshell. Overstimulated. Can't do it because everything is too much. Or understimulated. Can't do it because everything is too boring. Ah! Sir, it's time for your state-mandated Western animation-style shot. No, 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 Bazinga. Wow, Doc, thanks. I don't know what came over me. <laughs> hey, look, it's the oldest internet user in the world. Say the funny gibberish, old man. <laughs> Can I add you on MSN Pizzer Dura Win MX? 
Come, let me reimagine your favorite media. Man, this looks like a bad fanfic. <sighs> How dare you? You fans just don't understand. Hmm. Today I will cause incredible problems. Hey, Kyle. You want to cause the greatest urban fire in American history? Mm hmm? <sighs> I have a real hard time dealing with stuff lately. Everything seems warped. Well, you know, every generation has a different problem they deal with. And every generation thinks they are in the end of days type deal. It can be scary, because in your lifetime you'll see several generations, all with new, different things going on. Fear can be hard to deal with, so you gotta do your best to stay in the present and enjoy everything you surround yourself with. Mmm! What a fantastic day to be rich without repercussion! Captain Rich, you gotta help me. I can't get a home. Someone is buying all the houses on the block. Hmm. You're on my property. Look, I'm sorry, man, but I think you're the worst mage. How would you even win a fight, man? Boy! The ass is the largest muscle. And I believe in it. Mmm! Welcome to the Happiness Conference, everyone! Let's start with a big cheer! If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands! <sighs> oh, fuck, dude. Okay, we only get three wishes at this well. I think we should all wish for stuff to make the world better. Okay. Okay. I wish to end world hunger. I wish to end all war. I wish for rocking tits. Infinite milk! Hey, how'd the job offer go? I uh, turned it down. What? Why would you turn it down? You're the best invisible man in the world! I don't know. I just didn't see myself doing it. God damn it, Flork! Hello, fellow poor. Would you like to try this bug? We all eat bugs now. It's cheap and just like meat. Mmm, yes, yeah, see? It is so good. It is not disgusting at all. Look how much I just ate. Why? It's so good, I think I might be okay with working for $3 an hour now. Hello, I'm Dick. And this is my brother. His name is Balls. Your names are Dick and Balls? Are you making fun of the Scrotum Brothers? My god. The government is only giving us 15 trillion dollars. The company will have to cut back from 300 private jets to 299. 